Right now, there are a few areas that are exempt from a requirement mm -hmm. of this government permission mm -hmm. slip. Give us an example of one of those areas and how it's working. Sure. Well, there was some reform, and we can see the positive effects that would happen if we were to repeal this law. And back in 2005, um, there was reform where gastroenterologists or stomach doctors were able to perform colonoscopies in their own endoscopy units. So normally they would have to get a certificate of need permission slip to be able to do it in a lower cost setting, like their own physician offices or procedure rooms. But now they don't need to go through that process. And because of that, utilization of those services has increased by 28% in part because of the baby boomer population. More people going to have that yes, procedure done. Yes, more usage of this procedure. But at the same time, there have been savings of well over $200 million for the Medicare and Medicaid program. So that just goes to show how, I mean, repealing certificate of need is really a way to cut the low-hanging fruit and restrain rising health care costs under our system.